Hi, what's up YouTube? It's Stargirl the Practical Witch and welcome back to my channel. So I am here with a what I eat in a day video because I thought it'd be a really great way for you guys to get to know me a little better. Because Some of you were saying you wanted personal videos from me. I don't know why because my life is very, very, very boring. But we are going to do a what I eat in a day video. And we are starting off with breakfast. That's why I'm wearing this giant hoodie because in the morning I like to be as comfortable as freaking possible. And if you hear my neighbor shouting, it's just what happens when I record in my apartment. They are super duper loud. That's probably why I'm moving soon. Just a little disclaimer, the food is going to be spruced up for YouTube because if I were to show you guys what the food normally looks like when it's just me, you guys would probably be repulsed. And the reason why I'm doing this disclaimer is because sometimes when I watch what I eat in a day videos, the food looks so perfect and I'm like, how do these people have time to work, do YouTube, and also decorate their food like it's it belongs in a magazine. So if it it looks real fancy just know I did it special for you guys but it's pretty much what I eat in a day so with that I'm just gonna go right on to it let's start out with breakfast yeah let's go So for lunch, I want to give a quick shout out to my friends at Blue Apron for sponsoring today's video. Not only did they hook me up with some of their amazing vegetarian meals to share with you, but they are also giving $80 off to the first 100 people to sign up using my custom link in the description. If you're not familiar, Blue Apron allows you to skip meal planning and grocery shopping, get exciting recipes and quality ingredients delivered right to your door. As you you can see they send you perfectly portioned ingredients that minimizes food waste and makes cooking great meals super simple for cooks of any skill level trust me guys i'm practically no good in the kitchen but blue apron makes me feel like a pro so not only do you get 80 dollars off but their meals are super cheap starting at 749 per serving with three different flexible plans to choose from i'll be showing you some of the vegetarian meals but they offer a mix of meat fish beyond meat and health conscious plans to fit your lifestyle. Blue Apron not only saves you a lot of time, but they offer 11 different recipes to choose from each week, and the food is delivered in a refrigerated box so they'll stay fresh even when you're not at home when it arrives. And did I mention there is no commitment? You can skip or cancel the service at any time. If you would like $80 off your first four weeks of Blue Apron, click the link in the description box down below. You will not be disappointed. You just saw me make my lunch with Blue Apron and the meal was so good. It was so easy to follow the instructions. Everything was practically idiot proof. <laughs> it was just a really fun experience and it also made me feel really good while I was eating it because I knew I was putting really healthy ingredients into my body and also it was just really simple, really quick and perfect for my busy lifestyle. So this is honestly my first time trying this recipe. So let's see how it tastes. We're gonna get a little bit of spinach, some nochi, some mushroom, all in one bite to make the perfect bite. So let's see. This is actually really good. I don't know how some people eat on camera because I'm like scared you guys can see me chewing. Alright guys, so now it is about 7 p.m. which is around the time that I eat my last meal. It's around the time I eat dinner and by dinner I kind of just mean an assortment of different snacks because normally by this time I just spend all day editing a video, making a video or working and I just cannot 
be bothered when it comes to food. So by dinner, I literally just mean I'm gonna show you guys a bunch of different things that I snack on at night. And keep in mind, this is not a Victoria's Secret model what I eat in a day video. I'm trying to make this as realistic as possible. Try not to judge me. It's pretty much just me trying to be healthy, trying to get all my nutrients in as a vegetarian, but probably failing. So at night, I normally go to the freezer. And in my freezer, I mainly have like frozen vegetables, such as like rice cauliflower, because it's easy to make. And I normally have a bunch of frozen fruit too. The reason why I don't keep a lot of fresh fruits and vegetables typically since before Blue Apron is because I'm always scared they are going to go bad before I have a chance to cook them or get to them. It's just like too much of a commitment for me. I guess it's like a really Sagittarius thing. So most of my vegetables and fruits are frozen. And also when you eat frozen fruits, it's like eating ice cream but not really eating ice cream. Or at least I like to tell myself that when I'm trying to be healthy so normally at night for dinner I have like two large bowls of frozen pineapples blueberries or whatever I have in the fridge and yes I know with this hair I look like a giant blueberry so it kind of fits but So I don't just sit there and eat fruit all day, obviously I like carbs, I like salt, I like junk food, I like snacks. So normally with my healthy fruit I will also have, you know, like an assortment of snacks such as pretzels, potato chips, or like soybean chips and I'll just eat this throughout the night. So normally while I'm eating my snack, I will study the astrological transits for the coming month and I think I forgot a napkin so I'm just gonna wipe it on my leg. That's really gross, sorry guys. But normally while I'm eating my night snack, I will study the astrological transits for the month so I can prepare for the horoscopes that I put out monthly for you guys. I actually use this awesome witch's handbook that I found at the Barnes & Noble that has all of the astrological dates in it and it's been really helpful in helping me study for the horoscopes. Alright guys, normally by this time I've finished the rest of my snacks in bed in my bedroom while I watch TV and kind of just lounge out and pick out until I fall asleep. Probably not the healthiest, but that's what I do. But that's all for what I eat in a day. I hope you guys liked it. Thank you so much for watching. Good night and I will see you later. Bye.